support us on Patreon to get access to member-exclusive benefits and first dibs on the latest Manchester United news. Hey, hey, hey guys, it's Old Man G here, back again with another video for Red Devil Studio. Apologies, I'm late on the Sancho train, so, but I've just been very, very busy. But anyway, to get into the news, before we get into news, sorry, if you're new to the channel, please like, share and subscribe to Red Devil Studio. Follow us on Twitter, UnitedX, and smash that notification button for the latest Manchester United news. So, Jaden Sancho, so this is actually coming from Sky in Germany, Sky in Germany, Sky Reporter in Germany. And Sky Sports Germany are basically saying, or well, essentially confirming, um, that Jalen Sancho will most likely leave Dortmund this summer. That's for sure. It's not clear which club, but he will be leaving in the summer. Now, the Sun and Daily Mirror, UK uh, papers, have said essentially that Manchester United and Chelsea um, are going to be battling for Jalen Sancho's signature. And Dortmund are saying that he basically is not going to leave Dortmund for any less then most likely a hundred million pounds. Um, so essentially, if Manchester he's going to snub City, we know that for sure. But if Manchester United cough up a hundred million or slightly less than that, maybe probably ninety million, I imagine he'll basically go. Now there are potentially other teams outside of Europe that might be interested, like maybe Real Madrid or even Bayern Munich, for example. They're obviously in the Bundesliga, possibly a PSG. But Manchester United, as according to Daily Mirror and Sun. Um, are at least want to be at least front runners to actually get Jaden Sancho's signature. Um, so, what do I think about this? What do I think? Um, well, I think let's be real here. I think the two things for me, I think, so I think there's a lot of you know Sancho talk, and I think I've seen a lot of articles and and videos about people saying you know it's almost confirmed, it's guaranteed. You know he's coming, he wants us, etc. I think. I don't know if you do this, but my personal opinion, I think the the right is if is if Manchester United do not get um, a top four finish, if we do not get Champions League football, then I cannot see Jadon Sancho um, going to Manchester United. Full stop. It's just not going to happen if we don't get Champions League football. It's not going to happen. And then the second thing is is that given the lack of money that Manchester United um, spend. Is it really, you know, is it, is it, you know, it's a bit, it's a hard stretch to think that you really think that Edward with the board are going to spend between 90 to 100 million pounds on one player. If that is the case, because if they do spend that money, then potentially that's the only player we sign. We might sign one, maximum two players if we spend that money on Jaden Sancho. Um, and I would argue it probably would end up being one player because apparently Bruno Fernandes was going to be a summer signing. So 90 million to 100 million on Jaden Sancho. That's potentially the summer transfer budget done. And the reality is that Manchester United, I think, need at least another two free players in January. And if that means sacrificing Sancho, maybe that might be worth it. That's my opinion. Anyway, if you're new to the channel um, and you like we're here, please like, share, and subscribe to Red Devil Studio. Follow us on Twitter, United X, and smash that notification button for the latest Manchester United news. Have a nice evening and cheers.